Namaste and welcome to Yoga for Manifestation, the yoga practice that is not just going to enhance your wealth, your strength, flexibility, stability, but also will help you to increase your manifestation powers. If you're new to this channel or to Yoga for Manifestation, my name is Svenja and um, you'll find actually a link in the description of this video where I'm explaining what Yoga for Manifestation is, how it is different from all other types of yoga out there and what's its huge benefits for you to practice practice it. So make sure you watched it and other than that, time for showreel. So for this video, we're just going to start at the beginning of our mat, standing nice and straight. Make sure your body is straight. Your feet are firmly grounded, rooted into the earth and your spine is lengthened. Feel, connect your body from your heels all the way up to your crown feel that whole length of your body and just close your eyes for a moment and take a few that deep breath and exhale slowly inhale deeply Exhale slowly. Bring your hands together in front of your chest. Hold pranam. And set your intentions for a powerful practice to be fully present. Focus on your breath and when you're ready slowly open your eyes and come back we're gonna start by just lowering our body down and now this can already be quite challenging for some of you but just try if you can actually without the help of hands just come into squatted position here if you need to be you can be on your toes and then you just work on bringing your heels into the ground you can also use your hands as a help next to your body if that is needed otherwise you just stay squatted and just feel the pressure in your ankles. We're opening our ankles to allow the energy to travel through. Now slowly bring your knees into the ground and keep your toes up. So you're gonna sit onto your toes and make sure you bring your back back your weight your body upper body weight is back your back is straight so that you can start feeling some pressure in your toes hands are placed on your thighs just stay there for a moment and feel that pressure if the pressure becomes too much you just um, bring your bum up slightly and then whenever you can bring it back down and just allow those energy points on your toes to open up and let the energy travel wherever we feel pressure it means we're opening up so it's a good sign pressure is good pain is not good so don't push through pain but um, ease off if you feel pain if you feel pressure it's perfect it means you're 
you open up your channels for the energy to flow. Now we're gonna bring our toes into flat in the ground, our heels out, toes are slightly touching in the back and sit onto our heels. Now you will feel the pressure on your calves. And when you're ready, start bringing your weight back and try to get your back onto the ground. You can use your elbows first and if that's how far you can go, that's fine. If you can, bring your full back onto the ground. Knees stay in ground and they stay together. So you should feel some pressure on your lower back now and in your thighs, your legs. So it's a very efficient movement to open up all these parts, ankles, calves, thighs, up, lower back and just hold there for a moment, breathe, feel that pressure, keep your smile, that's love attraction, how can we keep our smile during challenges? If we can master that, if we can, if we can welcome challenges with a smile, we will master life. Beautiful. Slowly, slowly bring your body back up. Now bring your feet out towards the side and now again try to lower your bump. This might be very challenging for some of you so if you can just be up here that's fine you just work on lowering your bump onto the ground if you can you just come seated like that a small kid would now laugh <laughs> seeing you in pain thinking like we're just sitting if you feel pressure it's okay we're opening up Beautiful. Now bring your legs out and just give them a little release, shake them a little bit, allow the energy to travel. Beautiful. If you need to massage somewhere, just give your body a little massage. Very good. So now we've opened the legs, we want to bring the energies to our energy center, to our core. So this is going to be a little challenging maybe. So in three, two, one, prepare your mind, lift up your feet, pull the toes toward yourself, bring your hands out, your back is nice and straight and just hold there in boat's pose. Feel how the energy is traveling down your legs now and gathering in your core. So we're strengthening the fire in your belly. We're building the fire in the belly because that's where your manifestation power comes from. So hold strong. I don't want to see any sinking ships be a nice floating boat. Hold strong. Five four, three, two, one, and sit in Sukhasan, happy pose. Now you understand why this is called happy pose. Mm, take a few breaths here. Prepare your mind. We're just going to repeat that one more time. Okay, so legs out. And you got this. Three, two, one. Bring your feet up, toes pointing to yourself. Legs are nice and straight. Hands are on the side of your body. Hold strong, be graceful and smile.
show the universe you're willing to build strength to receive more power. So hold strong, hold for five, four, three, two, one, and come back into Kassan. Again, take a few deep breaths. Beautiful. Now we want to open up our back a little bit so that the energy that we gathered at our core now can move up. So what we're going to do is we're going to lay on to our back. Here we go. Okay. Now move a little bit forward. And then you're going to try to bring your feet into the ground above your head. Your toes want to reach to the ground. If they don't reach, that's okay. You just stay wherever you can be. If you can reach the ground, just walk out a little bit to intensify the stretch so that your chest comes close to your chin. Just hold there. Feel how this is opening your entire back. Breathe, deep breathing. The mind is calm. You always want to keep your mind calm because our thoughts is where our manifestation starts. So be aware of your thoughts, keep your mind calm, keep focusing on breath. Beautiful and slowly, carefully come out. Bring your legs back, come back seated. And we just reverse that movement by grabbing our toes lengthening our back and with the exhale bring our elbows to our knees beautiful hold there feel the stretch along your legs and your back if this is easy for you just take an inhale and with the next exhale bring your elbows all the way to the ground next to your legs Hold there, feel the stretch, and slowly release. Now we're just going to give the back a reverse opening. So we're going to come into table position, four-legged stand. I just need to get my mic pack back onto my leggings. So there we go that is sorted so make sure that you have your uh, wrists directly in a straight line below your shoulders elbows are straight hands are have a tight grab into the ground just like a little bit like a starfish and also your knees are uh, in a straight line below your hips so from here, we're going to bring our right feet out slightly so that we can shift our body weight to the right side and grab our left ankle with our left hand and then just bring that feet up as high as we can. So now we're curving the back into the other side. So feel that stretch in your lower back. Hold there, hold strong. This is building your balance. If you fall, it's not a problem. Falling is not a problem. You just get back up and try again. Not being able to do is not a problem. Not trying is a problem. 
All right, beautiful, release, switch to the other side. So bring your left feet slightly out so you, you have a little bit of support there to shift your balance onto your left body side. Bring your right feet up with your right hand. Look forward and intensify that stretch. Curve your back. Bring that feet as high as you can. Hold there, hold strong. Beautiful, and release back down, back into table pose. Take a deep inhale, curve your back into cat position. Be a lovely cat. And now curl your back, bring your chin into your chest and now push your chest up between your shoulders. Push it up as much as you can. Curve it, curl it in, and reverse again. Inhale, look up, cat position. Exhale, curl your back, tuck it in, and come back, neutral table pose. Beautiful. Now take your right hand, bring it under your left hand stretch it out and just bring your body weight onto your right shoulder you can bring your head onto the ground and just rest there and feel the pressure on your right shoulder beautiful and we switch we bring the left hand out Thread it through and bring your head onto the ground. Bring your weight onto your left shoulder and hold there. We're opening up the upper body part now. Beautiful and slowly come back. Come back seated in Sukhasan. Cross leg position, happy pose. We bring our hands folded together, turn it out and with an inhale, bring it all the way up into the sky. Now lengthen your whole body, make space between your ribs and make sure you don't bring your Help uh, your shoulders to the ears, but let them melt all the way down. But still push your palms towards the sky. And lengthen your body. Breathe there, hold there. And with the exhale, now reverse your palms and bring them behind your head. As far down as you can. Feel the opening in your shoulders, your neck area, the stretch in your upper arms. And one more time, back up, inhale, lengthen that body some more. And exhale, back down. Hold there. Stretch there, beautiful. Now, you're gonna bring your folded hands at the back of your neck and now you're just gonna bring your elbows forward and slightly hold your heads forward and just allow don't pull just allow the weight of your arms to pull your head forward and give your neck a little stretch hold there breathe there mind is calm come back up bring the elbows out lift your chest open that heart give a smile to the universe and one more time bring the head forward allow the weight of your arms to just curl yourself in and stretch that neck
beautiful release. Look all the way to the right side as far as you can. Look all the way to the left as far as you can. Beautiful. Come back forward. Roll your shoulders. And switch. Beautiful. We've now opened the whole body. Gain some strength. Gain some balance. Balance. So we're now ready to go into meditation. I'm going to post the link in the description for a powerful guided meditation that you can do at the end of the sequence to now use that alignment, use that increased energy flows for your manifestation practice. So if you enjoyed this video and you've got any value from it whatsoever, make sure you click that like button, that subscribe button and the notif notification button to make sure that you get notified whenever we share more value for you to gain health, wealth, happiness in your life. Now bring your palms together in front of your chest. Take a last deep breath. Come back and have a great day. Namaste.